Every day, organizations around the world are targeted by cyber criminals using ransomware. The MasterCard Fusion Center is constantly monitoring cyber criminals that use sophisticated techniques to attack their victims. Our Fusion Center is committed to helping organizations avoid falling victim to these threats. Today, I want to focus on ransomware. It's a type of malware specifically used to encrypt the victim's data and then demand payment or ransom in order to restore access. Ransomware attacks are on the rise and are a popular technique used by hackers to extort their victims. So how does ransomware infiltrate your network? Poor cyber hygiene and lack of security awareness are exactly what the hackers need to take your network hostage. Ransomware attacks are typically delivered through malicious email links, email attachments, and website attachments and downloads. When a user engages with a malicious email or attachment, the infection is not immediately apparent. The malware operates silently in the background until the system or data locking mechanism is deployed. Then, a dialog box appears and tells the user that their data has been locked and demands a ransom to unlock it again. By then, it's too late to save the data through any security measures. There are two ways you can protect your organization from ransomware, and that is through technology and people. On the technology front, number one, back up your data on a regular basis. This is the easiest way to restore and regain access to your files in the event of any type of data loss. Two, deploy email filtering and scanning technologies. This will block the majority of malicious attachments. Three, ensure your systems and software are patched and up to date. If you don't, hackers will use those vulnerabilities to gain a foothold into your network. Four, implement a firewall and antivirus software. This will go a long way in preventing malware that could be ransomware from infecting your network. People play a critical role in protecting your organization from ransomware as well. The primary way that you can improve your organization's security awareness is through education. Educate your employees so that they will know how to identify common phishing tactics and instruct them to never click on a link or an attachment in an email from an unknown source. Instruct employees that before downloading attachments from a website, they should confirm that these attachments are approved by their IT department and are safe for download. If your organization falls victim to ransomware, paying the ransom is never recommended. This is mainly because it does not guarantee a solution to the problem. For example, the malware used in ransomware attacks typically has bugs that render data unrecoverable, even with the right key. Also, cyber criminals cannot be trusted. 70% of victims that pay the ransom do not have access to their data restored. By paying, cyber criminals will know that ransomware is effective and they'll continue to look for ways to attack your system and steal your money. Instead, rely on your data backups to restore your systems. I'm Ron Green, MasterCard's Chief Security Officer, and I'm responsible for securing our network and the broader payments ecosystem. We are all more connected than ever before. Unfortunately, so are the hackers, fraudsters, and money launderers. Your security behavior has upstream and downstream impacts, so we're relying on you to do your part because security is everyone's responsibility. To help, MasterCard has partnered with organizations like No More Ransom, the Global Cyber Alliance, and the Cyber Readiness Institute to offer you free access to the tools you need to get started. And as you grow, MasterCard is here with easy to implement and simple to use security solutions that will scale with you to secure and enable your digital world across every interaction.